Now at 11, a wild ending to a CHP chase when the driver plunges the car into the Pacific Ocean, then tries to make a swim for it, but she didn't get too far. I'm Michelle Fisher. Joy Rand is off. Eyewitness News reporter Sophie Flay joining us live from Venice Beach tonight, where that woman had to be rescued along with her two dogs. Sophie, what a story. That's right, Michelle. It's unclear if the woman was under the influence. She was driving almost 80 miles per hour when her car got wedged into the sand and then she booked it into the ocean. Waves crashing into the silver BMW submerged in the sand in Marina del Rey. The driver stuck doggy paddling out at sea and two dogs rescued. Well, I was just hanging out with some friends at this bar and all of a sudden I see this car fly down into the water. Video shows California Highway Patrol officers chasing the speeding BMW just before midnight Saturday. Surveillance footage shows the female driver floor it onto the sand. She then ran into the water, CHP says. She's still swimming now. And we got a police officer over here. I don't know what he's going to do without a boat. An L.A. County Sheriff's rescue boat quickly arrived, tossing her an orange life ring preserver. She managed to get to the boat where two deputies helped her on board. It was like a movie scene a little bit. Yeah, it was really because the helicopter was flying really low, straight above her. Authorities escorting the driver off the pier and into an ambulance where she was taken into custody. According to CHP, it's believed one dog hopped out of the sandy car after the crash and was rescued from the water. Another dog was also taken in by authorities to West L.A. Animal Shelter. It's unclear if the dogs belong to the driver, who has not yet been identified. Crews in wetsuits seen trying to pull the car off the beach. How many people are here right now? There's yeah. at least, you know, a handful of people when that happened, and it's just a miracle that she didn't kill somebody. And while you don't see something like this every day, folks say... Venice is, is kind of gnarly sometimes. And Michelle, you might have noticed the car had New Mexico license plates. Plates. Investigators are still working to determine if the car belonged to her or if it was stolen. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.